you can put JavaScript in multiple pages. This sample shows you, looky here, I'm in the head section, looky here, I'm in an external file, and looky here, I'm in the body section. Let's see how it's coded. You can see our alert, which is what puts the text on screen, is in a script tag where you have opening and closing script tags directly in the head section. Now you'll typically either put your script in the head section or towards the bottom of the body of the page. And we can have it in the body. Looky here, I'm in the body section. If you are doing something and you want the page to load faster and you don't need JavaScript when the page loads, it's typical to put it right at the end of the body section. If you need the JavaScript while the page is loading, you should put it in the head section or link to it. And most commonly, and my preference generally, is to link to an external file, which ends in an extension of JS. And you can see we have the window.alert. Looky here, I'm in an external file. Now, alert and window.alert are the same code. When I'm doing it in a JavaScript file, the brackets program that I'm using will give me an error if I don't include the window.alert. It still works, but this is a little bit more correct, though the alert works by itself just fine. So that's where you can put your different JavaScript files.